What is the special about Buddha Purnima? Buddha Purnima is the largest day for Buddhists due to the fact in this day. It's mild belief three vital activities of the Buddha's lifestyle happen. His beginning, his attaining, enlightenment and his death for Nirvana. This day is referred to as the Thirish Bliss Festivals. Buddha's birthday, additionally known as Buddha Jayanti, additionally known as his day of enlightenment, Buddha Purnima. Buddha Purnami is a Buddhist present that is well known in most of East Asia and South Asia, commemorating the star of Prince Siddhartha Gautama. Later, the Gautama Buddha, who was the founder of Buddhism, according to Buddhist way of life, Gautama Buddha turned into born C. 563-483 BCE in Lumina Fall. The exact date of Buddha's birthday is primarily based at the ancient lunisolar calendar. The date for the birthday celebrations of Buddha's birthday varies from 12 month to year within the Western Gregorian's calendar. However, commonly falls in April or May. In Bond's year, it may be celebrated in June. In South and Southern Asia, the Buddha's beginning is well known as a part of Baisa, a peasants that still celebrate the Buddha's enlightenment at the day of the full moon and day. In East Asia, the awakening and death of Buddha are found as separate holidays and large celebrate in Baisak month of the Buddhist calendar and the Bikram Sambhat Hindu calendar. This is the motif in the back of the Tom's Baisa in the modern day India and the fall, in which the historical Buddha live, it is the celebrate on the total moon day of the Vaisak month of the Buddhist calendar. In Theravada countries flowing the Buddhist calendar, it falls on the total moon Upasata day, normally in the fifth or sixth lunar month. In China and Korea, it is celebrated on the eighth day of the fourth month within the Chinese lunar calendar. The date varies from 12 month to 12 month inside the Western Gregorian calendar, but typically falls in April or May. In leap year, it could be celebrated in June. In Tibet, it falls on the seventh day of the fourth month of the Tibetan calendar. 